welcome back to the channel everybody, it's Hannah from Stardust. Thanks for joining me for a beginner's ballet bar today. So you're going to need something to rest your fingertips on to be your ballet bar. This could be a chair or a work surface or a table and make sure you've done a little cardio warm up before we get started today and I hope you enjoy. Get whatever you're going to use as your ballet bar, maybe it's a chair or just a work surface and we're going to rotate our legs, so wrapping around our thighs to get a lovely first position. Now we're going to dance our plies facing the bar today. This is super helpful if you are new to ballet to keep our hips and our shoulders nice and square so we're not twisting. So what we're going to do is stand nice and tall. On the introduction you're going to gently place your fingertips on the bar. We don't want to be holding on, it's just there for gentle support. We're going to take a demi plie, so demi means little or half, plie to bend, so we're taking a little bend, so demi plie, stretch. Then you're going to rise up on your toes, keeping your legs nice and straight, and lower. Then we're going to take a grand plie. We go through a demi plie as low as you can, and then your heels are going to come off down to a full plie, back to a demi plie, and straighten. Lovely. Then you're going to point your foot to the side so you can do your right foot, if you mirror me, down to second position. Same thing, demi plie and stretch. Rise up and down, full plie, slowly down. So we've got four counts for our full plie. Lovely. Coming into a third position or fifth if you've done lots of ballet before. So one foot is coming into that arch for your third position. We repeat, demi and stretch, rising up and down, full plie, down, down, lovely. Then for today we're going to tondu our back foot and it's going to come in front and we repeat again in our third position but you should now have your other foot in front. Lovely. So let's try all of that with the music. So rotate those legs, wrapping around, head up, shoulders down. When you hear the introduction, you're just going to place your fingertips on the bar. Lift and place. Bend and stretch. And down, full plie. Remember, demi first, then full. Back to demi. Stretch second, demi. Good, feel those thighs working. Squeeze up and down. Now knees out over your toes. Squeeze those knees to the side. Third or fifth, squeeze. Good. Make sure we're not rolling our feet, all ten toes on the floor, and demi plie, full, back to demi, stretch, change feet, demi, and stretch, good, squeeze, keep those legs turned out, and down, good, back to demi, stretch, and finish. Good job, well done everyone. Good, what we're going to do now is our Batman Tondu. So we're going to take these sideways to the bar. So I'm just going to move my bar to the side. Lovely. And you want to just have your fingertips on the bar. So remember, not holding on too tight. Third or fifth position, arm down in bra bar. So Batman Tondu, Tondu means to stretch. So we're taking the arm out, prepare it on the introduction. We're going to take a Tondu Devon to the front and then pull in, second, out, close at the back, derriere, stretch, and in, and second, and in. Good, so that's Batman Tondu en croix because it goes in the shape of a cross. We're going to dance that twice, and then we're going to take a little demi plie and a releve in fifth. So up on your toes, squeeze those legs together, and then if you want to, you can let go and see if you can do a little balance today. All right, so let's give that a try with the music. So third or fifth, heads up. Good, standing nice and tall, head up, shoulders down, ready, out and in, out 
in, turn the back, out and in. Good job, remember to push down and along the floor. Squeeze those legs together every time you close. Good. Out and in. Out. Ready for our balance, plie, releve. Squeeze those legs together right up on your toes. And hold. Good. Open. And down. Good. Very nice, everyone. Well done. So we now need to do all of that on the other side. So you can turn yourself around or change your ballet bar and then get yourself ready in third or fifth to go on the other side. Prepare the arm. Head up nice and tall. Here we go. Out and in. Good. I want you to push down through the floor. Push away. Pull in. Push. Make sure we're turned out knee to the ceiling in second. Good. Squeeze those legs together. Well done. Keep that head up nice and tall. Arm held in second. Demi plie releve. Good. Squeeze those legs right up on your toes. Good. Open. And down. Good. Well done. Nice job, everybody. All right, we're going to go on to glissés next. So for this one, we're going to face our bars again because glissés can be a little bit tricky. So we're going to start in first position. All right. And what we're going to do, we just did our butt montondu and our accent was out. A glissé, the accent is out. In. So when I'm counting, we close on the one, two, three, on the number. So we're going one, two, three. So the glissé, our foot's coming slightly off the floor and the accent is in. So we're closing in on the count. So have a little practice. We're pushing out like a tondu. In, 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 in. Good, you got to get those feet moving quick. Good job. Have a try on both feet. You're going through a fully stretched foot each time. Good, so make sure it's coming just off the floor and your feet are working as hard as they can. So for the exercise, we are gonna do eight, starting with our right foot. So we're gonna do eight just into first today, eight with the left. Then we're gonna do four, four, and then two, two, and then we're gonna try one of each. One, 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 one keeping everything really, really still. So I've turned us to face our bars, just so that again, we can keep our hips and our shoulders nice and square. And it gives us a little bit more support if we are new to ballet or to glissés. All right, so let's give this one a try with music. So first position, heads up, shoulders down. Good, close on the count. Lovely. Fours. Four, three, two, one. Four, three. Now on twos. Two, two. One of each. One, 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 one. Good, well done, everyone. Good job working those feet with your glissés. Wonderful. We're going to do one more bar exercise. So turn your bar. Lovely, and we're going to do rond de jambe, okay? So this is round of the leg. So our leg is gonna go in a lovely round shape. And I want you to think about drawing a capital D shape on the floor. So we're gonna start with a tondu to second, make sure that leg's turned out. And we're going round to the back. Lovely, through a first position. So foot flat, slide it through first, round to a tondu devon and then open to second again. So try that again, keep that leg turned out. As you go round, pull up as it comes through first. Beautiful, good. We are going to take two rond de jambe en dehors, which is going outwards, so to the back first, through. And then we'll, we will do two rond de jambe en de don, which is coming inwards. So for en de don, we would come forwards through first, turn out those legs all the way to the back and round. Good, so look out that we don't come through parallel. You've got to pull those toes back. 
So you're turning out. And the same thing, push your heel forwards as you're coming through. Good, so we're always working with turned out legs. Lovely. When the music starts, we're going to prepare our arm and prepare your leg to second. And then we're going back for two rondes de jambe en dehors to begin. Beautiful. And back. Through first. done everybody let's switch because we need to do that on the other leg so I really want you to think that your leg is being pulled away from you so it's as long as it can be and that lovely round shape you are painting with your toes on the floor so set yourself up third or fifth and let's do it on the other side prepare to second going backwards Keep that leg turned out, and again. Good, keep pulled up on your supporting leg, and through. And close. Good, well done everybody. Now we're gonna finish today's ballet bar with one last exercise, which is our grand back run. So grand means a big, and we're gonna do big beats, okay? So these are our big kicks. So I want you to think about your tondus, which we did at the beginning of your ballet bar, where we were pushing through the floor and pulling back in. We need our tondus for our grand batman because every grand batman needs to start with a tondu. So we're going tondu and lift, tondu and close. Then we're going to combine all of those movements together to get more of a swish motion. Swish up, swish down, swish up and down. Lovely, same thing to second. Tondu and a lift and a tondu, close at the back and a swish, close in front. So wish close at their back. Good, so it's a divided grand batman to start with, just so we remember to go through our tondu every time. Same derriere, swish and a close, swish, then to second, divided, tondu, and lift, and tondu close in front. A swish, close at their back, a swish, close at the front. Good, very nice. Don't worry about the height of your leg. Obviously, if you've been doing ballet a long time, feel free to kick those legs up. But if you are quite new to ballet, just think about the technique and the placement. Everything up here is staying nice and still, and it's our leg that's doing the work. Rotate it round, make sure it's turned out and that both legs are straight. All right, let's give it a try with the music. Heads up, ready. Point, lift, point, and close. Swish, swish. Good job, second. Lovely, turn out those legs. Nice, derriere. Point, and lift. Now swish it up, don't forget to use the floor. Good, you've still got to show your tondus, even when those grand batman are fast. Nice, well done everybody. Okay, last one. Let's go on the other side. So really thinking about pushing down and along the floor and keeping those legs beautiful and turned out straight with pointed toes on the end. Here we go. Prepare the arm. Lovely, ready. Now push along the floor. Good, you should get that nice swish sound as you push your foot. Swish, swish, se 
step on it. Tongue you lift. Good. And swish. Swish. And finish. Beautiful. Great job, everybody. And that's the end of our beginner's ballet bar today. So feel free to give your legs a little stretch. Stretch out those calf muscles if you need to and your quads. Good job. Well done. Lovely. And a little quad stretch at the back. Give those legs a little stretch. Well done. I really hope that you have enjoyed doing a little ballet bar with me today and I hope you'll join me for some more dance very soon. Thanks so much for joining me for ballet class today, everybody. I really hope you've enjoyed that. Let me know how you got on with today's video in the comments below and don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Now, if you're new to ballet or if you're looking to improve your ballet, I've started a how-to series. So I'm doing lots of little video clips about different exercises that we do in ballet class where I break them down and go through lots of tips, tricks and common mistakes to look out for. So I've dropped the link below in the comments if you're interested and want to take a look. Thanks for dancing with me today and hope to see you again soon.